Hello once again everyone and welcome to Baldur's Gate 3 the lore series. As I told you before we are getting into some deep stuff. It's gonna be pretty it's gonna be pretty good. Now we have been accumul accumulating um a few things. As you can see Misora's right, uh, right there waiting for us to interact. Worry not that thing will not disappear. Maybe the mark disappears, but once we talk to her, the conversation remains the same. Interactions. We want to save that for later, though. For upcoming episodes. Because I don't really want to change a uh, team right now. We are going to remain the characters we got in the moment because, well, there is a lot to do with them. And it's gonna be pretty cool. So yeah, today we have a lot to learn. And we are gonna start going down this uh, this tribunal that we want to to find. I showed you in the last episode a few ways that you can get in. Uh, as you can remember, here's where we killed the the guy the the dwarf. And yeah, well, we're gonna make it towards that tombstone maker, tombstone shop. And from there, we're gonna start. That might be worth a look. Ah. I cannot use that, though. There's someone in here. I do not remember this. <laughs> I thought I was done for. Lady Luke, bless you. What the hell? Sightseeing. What do you think? I filched the wrong baldy and got myself. Buried for the trouble. Stone Lord, he calls himself. Oh. More like Stone Shies. <laughs> can, cannot you see him? Sounds like a punishment for thievery. A high and mighty type. Ahem. I don't know what to say about it. My ways and I'll never steal again. Happy. Ah, well. Look, I ain't got much in the way of thanks, but the stiff below, there's some fancy doodas. You're welcome to them. In any case, we do not want any intermissions today. We have a lot to see. So, as I've been telling you, I don't not want to change uh what it's the the team we're running with because uh well this is the place no this is the mortuary lower city mortuary established 1486 dr funeral rites coffins embalming well you guys already know where this is going We're gonna be seeing a lot of things regarding the um, like the ball spawn over the times. Never mind the shiny squares. I am more comfortable on streets like him. Hence why we're behind the mask. We got Yahiva and Minsk around. Yes, another thing we have in common. We're two bees in a pod. Those two Campbell Hallows tombstones. Very well. Must I look up its skirts? Jahira! What do you think of me? <laughs> anyway, we got the key. We got it from the dwarf we killed. 
Ah, and as I told you, you can do that from the kitchen and you can do this uh, as well from being a killer yourself, actually. Killing the targets will get you the password and all of that you need. Everyone failed the perception. That's pretty... <laughs> that's pretty messed up. Worry not. You guys know I tell you everything. Okay, we've read this before, didn't we? Clerk Stravich, remember you are in the business of making candle hallows. Tombstones look like a genuine retail establishment. Keep all the prices about half again to high, so you don't sell very much inventory. Think of the shop as a stage uh, rather than an actual going concern. The management. Very well. So. The check they failed. Oh, there is something here. If you seek the tribunal, let death be your guide. For what is behind death, boom, murder. Very well. That's a uh, check they failed. It's in this painting. We got a pattern here. This door unlocks. The locked door has red text on it reading. All are weighted. All are embraced. None shall escape. Right. We know the password. We we got the letter from the dwarf. But I'm just gonna give you this. Actually fuck that it's a twenty. The phrase sounds familiar, but you can't quite recall where you heard it. Anyway, I'll let you know things uh, when we see them. Don't worry about that. So we speak the word and we get in. Right. So this is not the temple of Baal. This is the way towards the the tribunal. Fists this way. So as you remember, we've been um, warning targets that are being killed by the Baal cultists. Uh, killing them and taking their hands, as you remember, it's the way in which they get into this tribunal to become a, a dev devotee, an acolyte of sorts. And this is the way to that tribunal. can see there's the ball seal oh very well present me well from gifts thine own or i shall rend thy flesh from bone all right which guards I killed to be here and took the victim's hand as proof where well, we don't have a hand other than the clown's hand and we cannot lose that and for myself that is not finer offering than the poison fruit of Baal's loins I don't really know if that works the thing with this part of the story is that it's just so different when you're a dark urge I got sort of purple magic artifacts that's not gonna do quite frankly gold either I can't rend your flesh but I can't dent your metal hmm I mean, we could. Very well. To passion's brash, thou art a slave. This sinful ground shall be thy grave. <laughs> oh, well, what was that moaning for? Be quick. Very well. 238, level 12. Ah, worthy enemies, indeed. Ah. I don't want to waste that, quite frankly. 
I think I could go another round. Always comes to this. Right. Ooh, I have a problem now. Yeah. Would have been cool to have this guy hitting on them. Uh phew. I guess we got the advantage of them being prone. Right. Not too bad. Never a dull moment. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna keep the eyes for next turn. Yeah, Hira's gonna take it off herself, really. Oof. Missing there. Ball. Come on. Come on, trip over. They barely move. Will be thy resting place. That's a lot of damage. Oh. Will be well. It's a lot of damage. Come on. Oh. What must be done? Hmm. I do have the great, uh, great, uh, mm. oh, it's what? Oh, okay. I didn't know that's how it worked. I thought it was just like the one shadow heart has. What? Oh, he's. Okay, I'm gonna try to kill him because this does not look good <laughs> at all. There we go. Now go back. Can I walk in here though? I'll strike you down. That was more of a of a reflect reaction. I didn't really want to use the execution. But yeah, lads, I know it's uh, just the beginning of the episode and I'm already fighting, but don't worry. We'll get our fair share of um story and Ravelin and lore today today is gonna be heavy just heads up heavy on lore it's gonna be a long episode from what i from what i can eyeball it sort of say sort of thing mm, they hit very hard My last butt kicking for goodness. Go for the eyes, boo. Go for the eyes. <laughs> Still on my feet. Iconic. Ooh. Motherfucker. There you are. Time to get going. Right. Oh, 
Oh, this is actually pretty nice. We'll take a look when when we finished. We do not want to deal with it too much today. But nonetheless, even the swords I think are really good. Well, no. However, this is. So yeah, a lot to look forward to. Got the key. Oh, look at that. That is really good. But yeah, as I said, look at the sword. The sword is really good as well. All this, I'm gonna take a look afterwards. Today, we have more important matters ahead. So, as I as you said, this is the council. When you get here, you have to present a hand or several hands. I don't know. So, you get an audience. Or, well, you can do what I did. Now we got the key and we can enter. You look at that. This is the tribunal. Are the acolytes and that is Sarevok. Sarevok, who was in the previous games, he's the Pulse Pawn uh, from previous games. In Baldur's Gate 1, you are a Pulse Pawn, but he's also there and you fight with him. Uh, well, a lot of context and things are going to be given to you to, uh, alongside this episode. So, I spill that. And let's get to it. You gaze upon murder's progeny, child. His most ill trusted zealots. His faithful departed. Prodigal servants. Each returns to do his bidding eternally. This is the court of the Dread Lord's Tribunal. I am its custodian. Here come those who seek to transcend. Aspirants of his most profane order. The would-be unholy assassins of Baal. But these are not aspirants. You have brought traitors of Baal into our midst. Harper Worm. The That's a reason to have hero. them in the team. Your keen sense for this city has withered in your absence. And you, man of stone, as you stood a statue, a helpless ornament, your city warped, changed, became ripe for the plucking. Sarevok, Baal's least favorite son. Still proud to tie these apron strings, I see. You disappoint me, child of murder. I expected more of your return. Sarevok Anchev, a relic of your cursed line. A Baal spawn who failed to become chosen. And yet, the history he shares with your companion seems to run almost as deep as your own. Ah, uh, yeah, there you are. What purpose do you have in bringing these heretics to the court of Baal? Speak, or death will be your final word. So he's a fanatic, but it seems like he's not um, very favored in the eyes of Baal. Uh, well, let's let's say let's say this. See a little bit what they say. How do you know each other? Simple. We beat him about the brow and butt until he was dead. <laughs> Sarevok once fancied himself Baal's chosen, until we put him in his place. Feel no shame for forgetting him. History shall do the same. These two have long meddled in my affairs and my father's. So, there is a thing I cannot tell you because I don't know. But supposedly he dies in the previous games. Uh, it is not explained how he comes back to life. Apparently it is in an expansion of the second game. I forgot the name. Uh, and you can even have him as a companion. I would say so yeah as I said I don't know much about that we had to play those games in the channel or something but yeah it is not explaining here how he is alive again 
I seek the path to the temple of Baal. Would you, <laughs> would you two like to kill the old man or shall I? <laughs> That's fun. Mm. You get to my age. You have already done everything. Be my guest. <laughs> we have already smashed Seravak's soul from his body once. Boo says it is your turn. And so, the Harper and the idiot Ranger raise their weapons against Saravok once more. You disappoint me, child of Baal. I had heard such tales of you, tales of grandeur and vile glory. But the company you keep has tainted you and pulled you away from our father's grace. I understand. I once fell to hubris, as you are falling now, but no more. Baal will never again have cause to question my devotion. Shut Not the fuck up. Spawn. You will die as you have lived, a heretic, forgotten and unloved. Blood to blood is Baal's sacrifice. He's and projecting. I shall be the knife that spills it. Oh, there you are. Oh, there it is. So. Oh, the song. So, a few things here, lads. I believe each you kill gives him a different thing it can harm him or buff him or I don't remember if it was hitting him something like that but anyway look at this level 16 uh, never seen a level 16 2020 20 6, uh, 16 14 resistances none but that will change you will see 262 HP there is Sarvo Ganchev, Justice of the Mordor Tribunal. 80 kilograms. Yeah, my ass 80 kilograms, this this guy. <laughs> anyway. A better position. Let's get to it. I reckon I want to clean these idiots first before going towards him. You see, these are more normal. Okay, something happened to him. Absorb essence. Legendary resistance. Affected entity has plus 10 bonus to its next saving throws. You can use this three times. Oh. Permanently hastened. Hastened. Cannot be paralyzed, restrained. Have his movements been reduced in any way? Well, if that ain't something, huh? This is the easy part. Okay. Enough circling. Immune. I should have started with that one. We could have put some damage into him when he was down. Weep if you wish. Now. Oh yeah, I forgot that I wanted to do that. Well, gone in dash. And just try to get as close as I can. Next turn is his. So that's gonna be interesting. Can't do really much. Very well then. Are you on a trip? Oh. He's going for Yahira. Oh my god. Okay, so he doesn't hit hard, but he hits a lot of times. He, oh no, they gave him Sanctuary. What a fucking idiot. Fucking idiots. Who gave him the sign? It was this guy, right?
Oh no. Still has got sanctuary. I don't remember how that works. Very well then, let's see. Okay. Immune to paralyze, I forgot about that. I'm an idiot. And missed Orders. on everything. Let's use this. Oh. oh, he's healing himself. That is not good. That is not good. Taking all my It's taking every turn of mine to To now make sure that she doesn't die in her. Oh really? She's gonna die. This one is slowing me down. Still standing, no matter what you heard. Okay, there we are, half HP. That's it. But he heals. Okay, not too bad. Okay, if you can die with that one. Oh my god. She's still alive. Fucking idiot. Now I can move over there. Well, I'm just gonna get... Uh, I don't have resources. Okay, good. It's the it's the constitu uh, 
this thing. <laughs> it's plus 10, dude. Holy. Okay. There we go. Well, no, she's not dead. Just a little touch in the butt. She's all good now. Well, there you go. Sarebuck. Look at this. Judicial seat. He's got the amulet of Baal. Up at a key. Map of the Baal temple. Uh, use a round street hatch to enter the city sewers. Proceed northwest to find your way into the undercity ruins. Blood the skull to pass the door. Follow the trail of murder to the Baal temple door. Brace Baal. Uh, there you go. And we got a few things. Sarebox horn helmet. This is very good. For a per uh But yeah, this is very good. We're gonna give it to uh, to Minsk. This sword. Uh one till six hit points. Well it's got a rush attack and it's actually pretty good for a paladin, so I think this one will use. But the key and the amulet of ball. Uh let's have a look. Inflict bleeding upon targets that have maximum hit points. That's pretty good. And we are um, proceeding towards what we want to get. That is uh, just unraveling this whole pal cult stuff. We have a lot of things to do as well. Don't forget, we are doing the whole thing with the clown. Uh, we have to go to... To Aileen. Aileen uh, wants to face that wizard that is looking for her. Don't forget that we've got lots of things to do. And I'm just sending a few things to to the camp because we are too heavy encumbered. Very well. Mason's Journal. Never in all the years of my craft have I left I was carving my own tomb. This armor husk I once thought a man. He has uh, trapped me here during the renovations where he says I'm free to leave after the work is done. Ill made uh, this uh, God, uh, God's awful smell. I'm no fool. Oh, well, there you are. But in any case, yeah. So I don't really know what to do with this sword. I think we'll make a uh, uh, a bill for lay cell. I'm not entirely sure how. But we're gonna go with this one from now on, I think. It's pretty good for a paladin. It's, it really is like a paladin sword, you know? Uh, as for anything else we found. This one is really good for him. And the amulet as well, why not? How many die today? How many die tomorrow? Well, in any case, this was the tribunal. There's a lot of things to be seen here uh, regarding reading and, and lore. But now we got the key. Uh, well, no, I think these are the keys to the prison, yeah. There isn't really much to see, uh, though. They don't really keep many prisoners. The bodies of our lambs must be nourished. An exclusive deal has been made with the runner of a mass grave co uh, corpse yard in the medic peatlands. Oh, so they're eating them. Sir Buck body will be added from now on as a side to every meal for the faithful. If the prisoners don't like it, they can starve. Although here there is someone, a, a fist, 
Oh, a headless fist. Oh. Well, this is a lot of a lot to read. Mm. Well, but it's basically a personal story from this uh, for this person. You want to read it? Feel free to pause it. We will be doing and uh, we will be doing a lot of reading today, so I will be saving it only for the important stuff. This is mostly to be uh, Saravox chambers. Legacy. Uh, what does it say? Ledger. Um, well, this is just explains everything that we've been after. The assassins and all of that. Around the city. Yeah, the guys are very difficult to fight, uh, but it's part—it's just part of something bigger. You'll see why. Look at that! It's Valeria. They got you, huh? Citizen, thank the gods you're here. My wrinkles are starting to chafe. As an officer of the law, I demand you free me at once. No, oh, oh, fucking idiot. Careful, I bite. Get here and free me at once. Yeah, shut the fuck up, I kill you. Thanks for freeing me so quickly. No idea what those Baalist Burks had planned with me, but those chains were starting to chafe. Though I do wish you'd figured this all out before I... Uh, put the blame for Father Logan's murder on that poor refugee. Well, at least it's over now. Yeah, it's far from over, mates. If I know Baal, this isn't over, yeah. You might not be finished. I am. It's plain to see that I'm well out of my depth here. But you... Well, you gave these reprobates a proper seeing to. You clearly have what I don't. Courage. Insight. Heroism. The city needs you. I overheard these pigs talking. There's a Baal temple deep within the old undercity that the cult is using. A century ago, it was destroyed by a group of heroic swords. Let's hope history repeats itself, eh? Mind who you call history, Holyfant. Oh, oh. <laughs> is correct. Who remembers the stench of the temple still? Very good. Now, let's talk and find that temple. Oh, fucking. This place is piss. I'm out of here. That guy is quick to give orders to say hey. Quick pipe. Uh, hookah. Damn, you do a lot of smoking, don't you? Alright, so this is very interesting. Feel free to read it if you want. I cannot because the episode is already gonna be long. But it's pretty good, it's pretty good. Feel free to pause it and read it. Well, hello. Should be easy. Let's see what we got here. Oh, critical. Marrow's memoir of my my death. Describing in detail the visions of Baal, seen by Sarvoganchev after his death in the Baal temple centuries ago. The brethren uh, often ask me what was it like to die. They expect me to represent a warring conflict, the humiliation of defeat against the honor of sacrifice. But once dead, it is impossible to think of oneself, of life, uh, for you are a Baal in Baal's own embrace. Baal's domain is a red wasteland in a starless sky. Halted in time before the collapse of this final sun. There I wonder testing uh, the end of all things. I was struck uh, back from the 
press the buy uh, bound to living husk again by my mocking sibling i resented it at first and i have forgotten how to breathe to eat all the animal functions of the petty who cling to life but when i was uh, cruelly resurrected my faith was bolstered more through my death than it could be through life i'll bring balls uh, about balls perfect finale the melting of the crimson sun above the lakes of blood it will happen this world will be carved in his image Ooh. let's move so yeah they had him here um if you don't know what this is this is a ritual if you are a bad guy of the, a bad dark urge uh, sort of speak well this is how you get here you you proceed with the tribunal, they accept you or whatever, and you kill this guy. Blood flows through this, you bathe in that blood and, and all that. It's pretty gory. But, we are done with this. We are done with this place. We are far from over though. Let's get out of this place, we cannot teleport in here. Uh, oh, you, yeah, just so you know, you can do the whole run around and surprise them and um, something like that you miss the dialogues of course so it's up to you in any case let us proceed right Uh, nobody knows what's going on. Everyone walking around outside of this, um, of this shop. Nice music playing around. And we're dealing with bad cultists. In any case, so, we got many things going, remember lads? Not only the whole bad cultist stuff. We are hunting down Orin. Not only that... We have to go and ambush uh, that wizard Lorwakan with Aileen. <laughs> Not only that, we have the, the clown mission going. Ah, it's a lot, it's a lot. Let's go rest. We need to rest really quick. And we'll get going. Nobody wants to talk. Well, she wants to talk, but don't worry. If we rest and the, the emoticon it's gone doesn't mean that the conversation that you lost the conversation we will still have it we're just gonna save it for a more appropriate episode mm, very well Oh, cinematic? Oh no, okay. So yeah, we want to know what the hell is going on. I didn't use the rest, did I? No. Pretty well, so. As I told you with hunting down this bad cultist and i think with that we do have a yeah a tp to the under city ruins that's from where we're going to take you might remember this this the um, the usual pal looking sigil with the blood stains and whatnot now however We got the amulet. approaches once more. Show a proof of faith. Spillage. Spillage. I have an, an amulet of Baal. Let me pass door. Door. Worthy hands hold proof of faith as the dread lord desires. Walk in blood. So I'll, uh, a lot of um, a lot of explaining about Sarvok. I will be doing along uh, during this episode. You might have thought it was a pretty brief moment, 
don't worry. Just stay, stay, stay with me. You'll get to. Hmm. I didn't mean My to do friend. that. Now we have settled the matter of the guild. I fear there is something I must tell you. You and Boo both. It may shock you both to know, but Minsk and this Stone Lord, they are one man. Oh. <laughs> what the well. same one man. And that same one man is Minsk. <laughs> Alas, alas. <laughs> uh, Minsk does not blame Minsk. Minsk blames the Stone Lord. But if the Stone Lord is oh. Minsk, then, well, uh, Minsk grows dizzy. I wish uh, to believe the Stone Lord's evil was the worm alone, attainting my thoughts with foul tongue. But I see now the dawn was within Minsk all along. So I wonder if Minsk can be a villain and Nine Fingers a hero. Must it be so with all creatures? Is there good and evil within us all? Oh. <laughs> Boo calls this nonsense. Less thinking of bad thoughts, says he, and more breaking of bad bones. But still, I would hear what you have to say on the matter, my friend. Simple man, usually deeper than most overthinking folk. As usual. I have to believe this has been a dark urge, you know? Makes I sense. See. In the case of Nine Fingers, perhaps it was all bunched up in that finger she lost. <laughs> it shall be for Minsk and Boo to be her virtuous pinky. <laughs> it is strange. A worm sits within my skull, twisting my thoughts. But it is you that have made Minsk see the world anew. You, my friend, are the true parasite. Ah, man. There is good and evil in all. Let us go crack villainy skulls so that the virtue might leak free. Yes, Boo. I am becoming yeah. something of a philosophizer. Yeah, very well. <laughs> That's very good. I didn't even mean to talk to him, uh, but that was funny. I'm just trying to get this note uh, playing on, on console. To gain admittance uh, to Baal Temple, you must cross man's slaughter chasm. But if you are weak, like this uh, aspirant, the far slayer will deny you passage. Defeat him or die. Very well then. Grimlock, verse 3. E is for Elkan by Gromir Betrayed. F is first murder, the Baal Primitive Save. Oh, we all lost the perception. Bollocks. Ow. We are all surprised. Nobody has a turn. Damn it. Very well. They go invisible. I explain you the movie here. As you as I uh, we read in the notes. This is a test. We need to pass to pass basically. So we can gain admittance. We got those guys here. And this is the one casting a ritual chant. It says that um well we can die when he casts the word, basically. I'm not entirely sure if it's a, a turn, turn based thing or if it's, uh, it has to do with the actions. But in any case...
Right. Uh, lads. You saw the cut. It's because... Uh, well, I explain it. I explain you why. So... I don't know why I started to fight everyone that was spawning. Like, I, I thought I was just gonna get to loot them all. I was, like, on autopilot. I shouldn't have done that. The very important thing here is that you just go towards this guy. Uh, and I was killing everything, you know. But we're gonna send two teams just like we did before. Uh, well, you didn't see that. I cut it. I cut it off probably. But because you want to fight, you want to kill the guys that show up here. Uh, so a split in two, maybe, and in teams of two, with uh, send a, send two guys to kill this group because they have a loot that's kind of cool. But with the rest, just go towards this guy. Don't worry about the others. Uh, so, in any case, um, just like I did before, no, not that one. And, the, the, yeah, the, I don't know why the video got really long uh, on that part, which is kind of ludicrous. Sure enough. Okay. Got those three idiots that are gonna hit us. Don't worry, this this whole thing it's um, easier than it looks. You can kill everyone, of course, and loot them all. I don't know if, the, if there's anything else to it. I I don't know the guy. It's a monk guy who fights with his feet, uh, with his fists. Sorry, here that gives uh, something cool. But other than that, I wouldn't really worry about it. Just gonna. Just gonna do this really effective and quick. Different to what I was doing before. So get these two guys. This is an this is not an strategic guide. I don't know why I was doing that. This is the lore series. We're gonna get to it. We want to get to it, lads. So yeah, it's like every six turns as well, so uh, turns as well, so um you are gonna uh if you take too long, you're gonna get characters killed. Characters from your party killed. So keep that in mind. Oh. What is that, a cloak? Don't remember that one. Okay, they all go invisible. Remember, we got Volo's eyes. Should be able to see them. Okay, Minsk. Another cunning dash. I'm gonna get moving towards... Towards these guys as well. And this guy spawns. This one in particular has something that we want. Right. Gotta take all the unstoppable off. And we are gonna go... These boots have seen everything. Hmm. Damn it. Very well, but set that already, so we're good. Okay, there you are. It changed camera like that because we're too far away. Hopefully we don't kill the Lance guy because the, the guy with the spear, he... I think he's the one that sends everything off when it comes to the... the... the this trial. Let's 
right. Second turn, I, I think that is, or third. Not entirely sure. Uh, hmm. Yeah, all right. I think I'm gonna send Yahira with me. Mostly because I have no one else. Hmm. Oh, there you are. very weak oh I didn't mean to do that okay there's the guy let me see there it is it's a very nice for a berserker a uh, proper berserker not like the one we got with Karlak that it's a uh, more a throwing stuff build and yeah, I think it's a better idea. If, although, by going through here, we're gonna trigger more people uh, this way. But it, uh, as I told you, you want to get to the to that guy. Still breathing, despite everything. Okay, let me see. It's going to stop bubble 5, so we got to take all of that off, basically. No way to get closer, that's sad. I wonder if... He didn't shove him off. Very well. Oh, that guy's still alive? Ooh, a styronit. Dying. I got no one close to him. Just gonna give him one of... Uh, one of them ultra super good healings. I didn't even remember about that guy. Delicious. Oof. Keep them guessing. Yeah, he's gonna start teleporting and whatnot. Almost. Yeah, it's pretty weird how to manage uh, this whole thing. Especially with those idiots, I don't like to deal with them. Because it's magic... It's magic... Uh, invisibility. Meaning that... 
not even with Polo's eyes I can I can see him. So we're gonna take all of that off. Okay, that's the last one. Use the action search on that. Because it's very annoying. Right, there you go, see? Sometimes the only way out is through. Can I shoot from here? Mm. That's not nice. Just gonna use the... Very well. That's a stallion, right? <laughs> you shouldn't be able to see him. You hit us pretty far away as well. Okay. Uh, Astarion got killed because of the... Um, because of the... Of the mark. Of the... Well, of this guy. That was too close, probably. <laughs> I'm gonna hide with this guy. Somewhere around here, yeah. Very well. Those guys are disappearing. And for some reason, these guys don't. I'm not gonna pretend like I understand why. But that's uh, sort of the way this thing works, right? Right. And that one disappeared. Very well. We need to go for a stadium now. So that is the trial, that is the test. It's kinda weird in my opinion, I don't really know how it works. Right. Looks like that hurt. Mm, gonna do that as well. And yeah, I'm just gonna use it all, really. 
at your command. The hero has this. There we are. No one stopped me yet. So, the key to this door is uh, inside that room, particularly. Uh, but yeah, there is a lot to see in this place. That's one of the reasons why I cut the fight so much, I th or I think I, I will do, because it's pretty... Yeah, well, it's pretty obnoxious. This is the guy. It's not a difficult fight, it's just time waster. This is the guy. It's a pile of uh, whatever that is. The music, dude. It's amazing. I mean, yeah. What's better than having a severe head in... When you're having dinner. It will... But yeah, in this area there is not much uh, that is meaningful to the lore. But it's interesting nonetheless. From here. This is just more like a... That might be worth a look. Like a bald church. Or, I don't know, lair. For bad cultists. Right. What is this? Manifesto. Right. So on a ball. The Lord of Murder shall perish. The Lord of Murder shall perish. Oh. Look at the scenery here, lad. Welcome. Oh. <laughs> what a way to ruin the moment. Welcome to the Temple of Baal. Now we're talking. But in his doom, he shall spawn a score of mortal progeny. What these statues are saying, it's basically the Baal prophecy. There is the symbol with the blood. Just place full of... Uh, weird looking worshipping stuff. Uh... We can come this way, really. Before anything. Oh. I, I actually have no idea what this is. Let's have a look. Rats. They swarm when an elder brain is near. Oh. Must be close to its place. Right. Right, right. So this is the way the game has to tell you that you are going maybe towards the end of the game or something like that. But obviously, we do not want that just yet. That's cool. I forgot the name of the prophet. I was going to talk to you about the... Um, about the prophet. We are making our way towards the lore, guys. This is where it's gonna get interesting. Eyes for Isla Sera, Balls born fighter mage. J is for Jergal. Exhausted by age. Jergal. Who the fuck is Jergal? Eh, well, no, we come from here. What the fuck is... I probably should do one of these. Just so we, we get a... Or the bonds within. More spells back. Let's pick this up. This seems to be right. Yeah. It's not rotten or anything. Don't open. We might as well bear our buttocks to every archer within a mile. Oh. oh no. They do not like that at all. <laughs> from their passage 
So yeah, that, that whole thing, it's the whole uh, prophecy. He's telling it to us one by one. Traps. Well, there you are, the wise. Um, very important, maybe important. So it's things that I know already that I don't want to pretend I don't. This guy th here. This one here. Oh, okay. This one here. Clown's severe head. The effigy of a Melisand who grasped divinity uh, will use her betrayal. She thought herself perfect, but forgot uh, the one she served. Below is an exterior signature written in blood or in the red. Very well, so here's the head. Wait, I know this head. It belongs to Dribbles the Clown. Precisely. Pieces of the clown put on display. Not my favorite kind of puzzle. But Alondo did not see. Alondo, that was it. Very well. Oh. Oh, there is a chest. This is what I was looking for. We don't even need that gold anymore. We're stacked up. We got the waypoint. Hmm. Fair enough. Here we are, lads. He's going down. Ooh. Trap there. Plant your feet with care. But Alondo did not see. He did not know. He did not revel in the glory of what is to come. Creepy. All right, then. I got no clue how to do this. I don't want to disarm every trap. If I was to jump here, do they jump as well? They don't. Oh, it's you! If motherfucker! Oh, master, master, master! You have come home to your royal dwelling. <laughs> but why did you exert yourself? The Baal so Temple. Here, I was waiting to open the door. Lady Odin told me not to let you in, <laughs> but I'd never listen to the pretender to your fetid throne. Howdy. I went through the whole tribunal when you could have opened the door. Yeah, I would have told you so, but didn't dream of interrupting when you were enjoying yourself so. <laughs> Gods. Oh, very well. What were you doing this whole time? The temple is all tidied and ready for your worshipful act of mortal combat. The eye sockets what? of our graven god's icon are all polished up, ready to glow menacingly as you bludgeon your sister to death. I've restacked every pile of skulls and mounted more skeletons on the walls for a cozy touch.
you've seen Orin. We are unfortunate bunkmates, as she refuses to leave your estate. Every day she kills me as I'm trying to beautify the temple for your return. Up to thrice, some days. Being killed by you is so much more pleasurable, Master. Very well then, open it. Okay, lads. A thousand succubi could give me no greater delight. Lord promised, There's Lord delivered. Blood on the floor as you walk in. Careful, don't slip. It's time. This is a foul place. Better bury it. Already, Boo is bristling, and not from the cold. I confess that the last time I came here, I thought it would be my tomb. You can see why. We're here, lads. Oh, look. There is a few things I would like to show you before we get down to business. For starters... Oh, look here. Gildran Glairon, the, the smith. This is the blacksmith in Rivington, in Baldur's Gate City. The one in which she transformed herself. This here is the journalist in which he, she also transformed when we met for the first time, I think, in Baldur's Gate. Over there is Orin. Halcyn is in the table. Remember, she captured him. And this thing's about to go down, not before some lore, of course. But this fight's a big iffy it's a lot of things just a little heads up well, uh, i don't have the healings I, I mean i don't have the the blessings i think so i think i'm gonna put haste on this guy a starion i'm gonna give him this thing as for me uh, well, I think I'm gonna take one of those as well. What is it? For the uh, well, that's for the for, in case I I have to use it, the bow, right? And I'm gonna put the haste on myself as well. Okay, it's time. Attention, lads. You are a mangled blood brain. Thinking father could be refused. <sighs> I know what you did. Spilled my grandfather's crimson. He was mine. He showed me the way. How to slice and slit. He guides my dagger still. Did it think it could protect? Did it think it could save? Only the blades can offer salvation. There you have it, lads. Grandfather, so Sarabok. It's Odin's grandfather. And here's the thing that many people don't know. So... Sarabok had a daughter her name was Elena, I think. And she was mad mental. Like, her mind was dust, right? She had a daughter. That, it's Odin. Uh, so, Sarabog, it's Odin's grandfather, basically. Odin 
killed her mother uh, the reason why we don't know just yet uh, uh, you'll see why but you'll see uh, Sarabok got mad when that happened like she was like oh she cannot kill my daughter right um, but Bal himself told him uh, basically don't you dare uh, stand against Oren because she's, uh, she's now under my blessing basically right that's when Oren became Bal's chosen but she wasn't chosen really yeah? you know she was our uh, oh well I cannot tell you that you'll see why but in the mean in the meantime that's what you can get on the lore don't worry we'll get more so far we're gonna persuade her because she can actually kill the hostage in this situation so you make meaningless offering it is my blood you must spill 25 You do not lie, underling. It is your blood I am destined to spill. Your death spit will stain these walls, little lamb. <gasps> you still don't remember, do you, bloodkin? <laughs> How you screamed as my knife slit your skull. That's my voice. Your brain juices. That's how, that's us. Sweet. A little hole big enough for the worm. Your body, a blood sack to feed it. The favorite of Baal turned meat puppet, strung up by the sinews and plucked by my hands. The truth you had forgotten. You were the favorite, the chosen. Orin was your subordinate. You led the cultists of Baal and orchestrated the absolute plot. It was your genius, your cruelty, your design. At your moment of greatest triumph, when all the pieces were in place, she betrayed you, infected you, and took your place. Maggot, a ball spawn, slip sliding in filth with these pigs. You don't deserve the murder lord's blessing. There it is, lads. So, this is the thing. We were the chosen, we were the uh, favorite, as she said. As the narrator said, that is the memories that were lost to us. And uh, what we got to know about it, from Gortash is that it's it was all my idea. It was uh, the absolute the the comp plot the the scheme for Baldur's Gate, the rise of the of the whole religion thing. It was my idea, uh, basically. And Orin, uh, when she got to do the tadpole thing and she made it tangled with our brain, that's when we started to forget everything. And then, uh, as you remember, in Moonrise Towers, we meet a lot of people that remembers us. Because we, it's like we've been there before, and of course we were. We were the leader of, of, of that. We put together Keterik, we put together Gortash. The whole thing. So there it is. There you have it, lads. So see, you can even turn bad, even now. When I reclaim my rightful place, you'll see the power I hold, but no. I don't want Baal's blessing, I will uh, want to fight for uh, you for it. Forget Baal, it's your netherstone I've come for. It opens its lips and spews filthy lies. No, no, no. None can resist father's blessing. He tells me, whisper quiet, the lie. Must be cut from your throat. Come close, my death's heads, but keep your blades unblooded. Bar demands a Jew. He wants to taste my domination. 
An altar flowing with his own unwilling flesh. Draining, dying. Drip, drip, drip. You should have trained harder, master. <laughs> Would you imagine if it was an actual duel? A 1v1 duel? Right. A little attention here as well. So that it's the form that Baal takes to murder in on on the plane. Wait, what? It's an actual one v one. I did not. I did not know that. <laughs> oh, we're gonna blow her. Oh wait, hold on. She hits hard. I did not know. Oh my god, the way the fight changes, that's insane. But yeah, and never mind. To the matters ahead, what I was talking about. Um this is the form that Bal takes to commit murders on the planes, right? It only eats for the chosen as she is now. Hey, yeah, dude, I didn't know this would turn into an actual duel. I mean, we are broken to so come here and you want a 1v1. We are legitimately broken. Like... 175. Look at that. The way I did this fight uh, was basically everyone, 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 everyone here. That's how I had that fight. The divine never fails, come on. And if I get a good dice roll, we get the execution. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, let's even the plane here. Probably didn't even need it. Oh, she saved it. I still have another one. Ooh. <laughs> 3 HP that's so insane that's unfair even for her really we are broken oh but she healed okay There is something we are not going to get to see. I'll explain it to you. Master, you are the chosen one. Oh, no, 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 no. You are next. <laughs> you are next, mate. He is near. He I'm killing you. Comes for you. Holy shit. I thought it was Halsin. It's Baal. Fucking hell. Oh, look at that. That's so cool. doesn't have his hat 
Oh. That's fucking insane. I expected the other. But you live. And her blood is returned to me. You are my chosen. I have a gift for you, child. You will use it to lacerate this world. We don't want it. From your God, your father, an offering of his affection for you. A confirmation that he owns you. Ugh. No god gives uh, selflessly. What are you asking? Return. Domination. Slaughter. Mountains of corpses. You standing atop them. You must destroy this world. It is what you were made for. For a moment, the brine pool of your brain clears. To die. To rest. To save the world from yourself. To accept. To become his prophet. In any disobedient subject to his lash. I've defied you before. You cannot force me to do this. family I know are those who fight by my side yeah no we are not uh, taking this path in any case you already know this has been 47 episodes you guys know uh, what we're always gonna choose you were made to conquer the hero news time in over a century silence falls over the Baal temple no chants no screams no prayers in the end your own death brought you more joy than any you wrought on this land you are slipping into peaceful oblivion do they but your journey is not over Thou hast defied Baal, Withers. thy liege and father, and in doing so hast earned a place among champions and heroes. Withers. But alas, thy courage was in opposition to the divine cosmology that bound thee to the lord of murder. Thou art now faithless, godless. And do want to wander the fugue plane for eternity. I will not permit that, though all the powers of life and death dictate that it should be so. I too still hold some power, and I invest a portion of it in thee, who have challenged the gods and now liveth to tell of it. Who the fuck is thy this fight guy? Thy is not over, and it is thy fight. For one who can look upon Baal and oppose him can survive any crisis. So rise, challenger of gods, and challenger of gods. For battle once more. Death will not claim thee whilst I... 
No. Who the fuck is Withers fan? Yeah, who are you? What the fuck? A scribe, a seneschal, a keeper of records, and now thine advocate, both here and in the city of the dead. Deserve to die for the evil I have done. Hmm. I truly th think that our character would feel that way. The sole way to atone for thine actions is to do better in a new dawn. That dawn has come. Baal tried to extinguish thee, but his wrath is imprecise. He only succeeded in killing the part of thee he knew. The urge that drove thee to terrible acts, the spark of brutality that made thee his. But there is a new part of you that hath grown during thy travels. That is all that we played. That part Baal could not extinguish, and so... Instead of destroying thee, he hath made thee anew. The heart of a savior hath overshadowed the mind of a murderer. Thou hast vanquished thine urge. There is no more urge. Did you know my nature all this time? I know all. But to he state truths all. is to interfere, for the minds of mortals what? are easily swayed. My place, for the most part, is to observe. This intervention, the reclamation of thy soul, is beyond mine ordinary remit. But thou art extraordinary, and so are these times. Today thou art born anew. A genuine pleasure to meet you again, my friend. <laughs> Minsk had his doubts about you, little slayer, but Boo had none. You get to start over. To be the person you want to be. Not what someone else made you to be. Ah, uh, look at that. Greet the bloodless dawn, child of none. Child of none. Wow. Our enemies don't stand a chance. As it was, so it is again. A hero has risen from Look the at that legacy plane. of death. You guys saw that plane? Like... Bal uh, symbol fading as we as it pans out to your face. Oh, that was something, huh? There is no more dark urge. Carson is saved. Oh, oh I am alive. Oh, thanks to our skeletal traveling companion, no doubt. Every breath in this place reeks of corruption. I will return to camp. The air is cleaner there. Very well, I'm still on guard. I'm assuming these guys don't attack me anymore. They're no longer praying though. Another hat? I have a look at camp. And this is Oren. Gore pile. Mm, that's a lot of, it's a, there's a lot that she had. Mutilated carapies. We have a look to all of that afterwards. These things are good. But as I said, it's not the time and place, right? And this is the nether stone. Is the nether stone we needed, and there's the key to the altar as well. A thousand XP. You are born anew. 
the Emperor. Cured of all distraction. Good. Orin's Netherstone is in our grasp. And now we must look ahead to the other. Gortash. Find him and take his Netherstone. Very well. Yeah, these guys, I think I can talk to them. I don't know. You rejected your own blood. Your unholy provenance. You are no child of Baal. <laughs> you want me to kill you, you fucking imbecile. Something like In any case. So yeah, this was probably our role in the, this point, the earthquake. Right, so yeah, this was probably uh, my old room or something. Did, they, did this guy say something though? You're not making any sense. Very well. Cruor. That's a name, isn't it? All these records. And this is something I want to show you. Look at that. Oh. Very well. This is Orin's mother. It's in some sort of Iron Maven, or open Iron Maven thing. Well, there you go. Something I did not get to explain to you, that I think it's explained in a cinematic if we get the right dialogue, is that we know this is Orin's mother. However, although Orin thinks she was birthed by a, obviously her mother and a ballast, the truth is, she was the product of a very incestuous situation because her father, it's her grandfather as well, is Saravak. It is something she did not get to know. I think you can tell her at some point if you get the information from somewhere else. That is something that got over my head. I don't, re I didn't really remember to do that. Quite frankly, I didn't remember how. It's done. Little sister, whatever in the great ways are we going to do with you? Baal will never care that you waste your time posing your cor uh, corpse dollies. Baal doesn't care whether you give him the corpse of a pauper, a pauper or a king. At the end of the day, all father wants is death in droves. Death in all numbers. Uh, to sap away the life of his dull world. As swiftly as widely as we can. You plan, you plot, you preva prevaricate. He wastes his time. Baal doesn't need us to think. He needs us to kill. You kill beautifully and have talents in your shapes, magics uh, that I never will. But you do not understand Lord Baal. Perhaps it's falling, uh, it's failing on, of your diluted blood. As a mere grandchild, I am his sole living pure blood. I will accept no challenge from you until you show some damn respect. I do believe this is my writing on Orin. Yeah. That's probably the case. Manifesto. Leathery parchment document has fetid metallic odor. I, Orin, called the red by the Shalar, daughter of Helena, granddaughter of Sarevok Anshev, do vow in the name of Baal, my lord of murder, to serve his unholy will. I shall become an incarnation of slaughter and the pain and humiliation inflicted upon his temple by the ignorant masses of Baldur's Gate shall be repaid a thousandfold. This do I swear, and attest with my own heart's blood." Well, yeah, you can see Sarevok and... and... Sarevok, both Sarevok and Orin were... not really favorites to Baal. This mission on Gortash.
Um, all my stupid slots are kin. How many thousands will you mutilate before you learn to make their blood spill worthy of Father's altar? You deceive your god with these mindless flayings, and our temple know my temple decays because of it. It can't be so. It mustn't be so. The favorite of Baal must be one worthy of his name, one who serves him and only him. If you insist on shouldering the yoke uh, of this other so-called chosen, then I will craft you a better one, a worm to make you mindless as the altar meat you butcher. Uh, and I will restore this temple in Baal's true image, a glorious vision, built atop your festering corpse. So this is from Orin. And that would be it, lads. This is how we close this chapter. I don't know about these guys. I want to kill them all. Does not speak. <laughs> only stares. Her eyes are not only filled with zealous awe, but also pure hatred. Yeah, you you can do whatever you the fuck you want. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like I want to kill them all, raise them. But nonetheless, we are done here. This is how we finish. As I said once again, this chapter. I don't know if these guys have anything though. Only his hammer. We're gonna leave it to him. Rest well, blacksmith. The Baal spawn is no more. The Dark Courage is no more. And just like that, we will proceed. And yeah, I don't really know what else to tell you. This is it. I hope you enjoy it. It's been a pleasure having you around. And I'll see you in the next one. Thank you so much for watching.